Tonight, North Devon rallies to prevent further closures of community hospital beds. 10,000 people call for a debate on the future of health care in local communities. 10,000 people have called on Devon County Council to raise concerns with the government about community hospital bed closures. Campaigners from North Devon presented their petition at County Hall today. Councillors will decide in the new year whether there's sufficient evidence to refer recent closures to the Secretary of State. In 2013, 10 beds went in Torrington Hospital, then a further 10 in Ilfracombe in 2014, and last month, 16 beds were closed in Biddeford. Lee Rundle reports. Do we want our hospital beds? When do we want them? Now! What do we Campaigners want? lost this battle. A quieter contingent arrived at County Hall today with a new offensive. Thank you very much. A 10,000 signature petition calling on Devon councillors to support the fight to save community hospital beds. What I would like uh, the council to do is uh, have a, a debate at full council over the adequacy of NHS funding and I'd like to see from a, a result of that them, them writing directly to the government to um, outline why it is that uh, communities funded hospitals well community healthcare more generally than just the hospitals in Devon is inadequate. Two years ago North Devon had a hundred community beds today that numbers dropped to 40. Patients are being treated further from home or having to remain in acute hospital wards. If people have information that we require, they need to send it in to me. Councillor Richard Westlake is the man who will be responsible for moving this campaign forward, if that's what the council ultimately decides to do. We quite appreciate that there is real concern in the area. What we have to do is get it right, because if we don't get it right, the Secretary of State will just send it back. And we don't want to do that. We want to make sure that when the Secretary of State receives our evidence, that he can look at it and make sure that the decision he makes is the right one. The Department of Health said tonight that local health bodies have a legal responsibility to provide services meeting the needs of their population. They added the NHS would be receiving an extra £10 billion by 2020. Lee Rundle, BBC Spotlight, Exeter.